What's up everybody, this is Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to do an update video on NVIDIA app because they just pushed the new app with the DLSS 4.5. Uh, it's not in beta anymore, it's official on the NVIDIA app and something changed and <laughs> it will create more confusion so I'm going to explain it right away. So in the graphics section, we're going to go to global and before over there, um, in the DLSS override, we had the latest option. So latest was using the latest version of frame generation, super resolution and rear reconstruction. It's not working like that anymore. So I'm going to explain what is recommended. So for an example, right now, if you use recommended and you open a game and you select the performance or the ultra performance mode, you're going to use DLSS 4.5. So for performance, you're going to use the preset M automatically and for ultra performance you're going to use preset L. If you're using balance quality or DLAA you're going to use by default preset K. This is the recommendation of Nvidia but because I feel like they don't like the image quality right now at quality DLAA and balance with the DLSS 4.5. I'm using a 1440p monitor and honestly it's too sharp when using the new model. On my 4K TV, it's not that bad, honestly. I kind of like the quality mode with the um, preset M. But anyway, this is the recommendation right now. So if you want to use that, definitely use that. One thing that I want to mention, and I mentioned in my previous video, if you have an older card, 2000 series and 3000 series, you will have a huge hit on your FPS if you're using the LSS 4.5. So you need to think about that because if you want to use the performance mode and you don't want to have the hit on your FPS, you will need to force the preset K. Same thing here with uh, if you have a 4000 and 5000 series, if you want to use different model, you will need to force it manually, but it's not that bad on those cards because the impact is not huge. So over there, what you should do. So if you want to use performance and you want just pure FPS and you don't want to lose too much because you have a 2060, 2070, a 3060, something like that, my recommendation is go with preset K, force it manually over there and apply so you will always use the preset K. You can also use the uh, mode here, you can force it in the app. I'm not a huge fan of it because sometimes I'm changing it inside of the game. So I just don't want just to push every, all, always the same mode. But if you want to do that, you always want performance at preset K. Do it like this. Um, if you want to force the preset M because you kind of like M and you like the fact that uh, in quality you like the image because I don't know, you're playing 4K, 5K or something like that. Uh, definitely, you can also do that. For now, me on my 4000 series, I will use recommended and I'm going to stay at use 3D app settings over there because I want to make sure that I can select my uh, mode inside of my game. And I know in recommended, if I use performance mode, I'm going to always use the LSS 4.5. And if I want something different, quality, DLAA or balance, I'm going to use my preset K. So this is pretty much it. It will create more confusion for sure. But the important thing that you need to remember, if you have an older card, my recommendation is force the preset K over there. And uh, if you have something new, you can use recommended. But keep in mind, if you're using quality, you're going to use the LSS 4. If you're using performance, you're going to use the LSS 4.5. So this is pretty much it. If you have any question, just come in, in the YouTube section. Post me, first of all, your video card. What is your objective in your FPS? Do you need like 240 or something like that? What, what currently FPS that you have and which game that you are playing? Because sometimes it can be different. Honestly, in Red Sec Battlefield 6, uh, the performance mode, the LSS 4.5, I don't like it. It's too low res, too blurry. I like to use the preset K. So it re re will really depend on which game that you're currently playing. So that's about it. Don't forget to subscribe and peace, everyone.